All right. Um, I'm going to be discussing man defense. So there are two main offenses that um, are run, you know, bird stack and host stack. Um, man is effective against both. Um, the main aspect of man D is uh, the defense's athleticism and their ability to beat their man one-on-one -on -one, because it's a very one-on-one -on -one center D. Um, there's some poaching, not as much, and there's some switches and helping, but it's very centered on that one-on-one -on -one matchup. So in the vert stack, when you have, um, say the force is flick, you want to have your man on the right side or on the force side, and then the last man wants to be back in case, you know, somebody busts long. But it's very centered on the mark wants to hold them here, and the force wants to, or the defenders want to hold that, that force side. Um, and Ho, obviously, disc is here. You want to force them here, but at the same time, um, in Ho stack, it's very centered on swings and dumps. So the dumps and the swings want to be able to stop this, but at the same time, this guy needs to be able to stop that upfield cut. Um, the most advantageous disc position for uh, the defense is when it's on the line because you have a very limited number of throws that you can have make. So the, the man or the defense needs to be able to take advantage of that, that lack of available space. Um, lack of thrower skills, that's, that's good for the defense. If the, uh, the offense doesn't have a good break, um, if they can't get off that, that break side throw, then it's good because the defense knows that they're going to be on that side so they can play their man in or long accordingly. Um, field conditions, um, usually no wind and uh, good field conditions, like good quality of fields are helpful because um, both sides have an equal side or equal opportunity. Um, no wind is helpful because it's really, it's a lot harder to puck against no wind. Um, 